In this video, let's talk about the relationship between cost, revenue, and profit. So let's say a company has some fixed costs of $650,000 and a variable cost of $47 per item. That means it costs an additional $47 on top of their fixed costs every time they make each additional item. Uh, it's $650,000 just to, just to have the manufacturing plant open, all right? And then every item they make is $47 above that. They can sell those, though, for $63 a piece, so there's going to be some profit, but they need to sell a lot to, uh, to make up for, for this cost. So let's take a look, and let's just write down some stuff. Cost. Cost equals that $650,000 plus the $47 times X, where X is the number of items. X is the number of items. Not hashtag items, but uh, number of items. Okay, uh, the company can sell each item for $63. So what that means is our revenue, R, equals $63 multiplied by X, multiplied by the number of items they sell. Then what we need to know is profit. Well, profit equals the revenue that the company brings in minus the cost. That makes sense. You're taking money in and money is going out. And... The difference, then, is what you get to keep as profit. Hopefully, the revenue is more than the profit. Okay, so when is the profit? The profit then equals 63x minus that 650,000 plus 47x. Make sure you then distribute this negative sign. And that gives you that the profit equals 63 minus 47 is 16, 16x minus 650,000. So now what we want to know is when does this profit break even or, or when is it zero? Well, that profit is, is zero. Uh, that, that's the break even point. If the profit is greater than zero, then the, then the profit is is uh, they have some profit. So let's let's solve this then. Add 650,000 to each side, and you get 16x equals 650,000, and then divide each side by 16x, and you get x equals 40,625 items just to break even. That's the break even point. Now, I'll write that there, break even, to break even. If you wanted to make a profit, try to think real quick, how many would you have to sell? At least one more than that, 40,626 to make a profit. But to break even, you have 40,625 items. I hope that helps.